Hello my beautiful flowers, welcome back for another video. Today we are going to be stuffing paycheck number one of August. We are going to be hitting my cash envelopes, my sinking funds, and of course our 100 envelope challenge. So stick around and we will get right into the video. gonna take a minute and organize my cash here very excited for the month of August I have a lot of goals that I've set out for myself as far as my finances go I'm really trying to have quite a few no spend days so what that means is um, days that I'm not spending outside of just the basic bills and necessities so I'm not going out to the mall and I'm not um, you know going down to the gas station getting a, a drink or anything like that so that is my goal so let's go ahead and start with our cash envelopes we're going to head over to my wallet here and it looks like we have nothing left this week for envelopes so let's go ahead and fill these back up normally if i have cash left over i go ahead and i throw it in my investing envelope we will be counting that later just to see how much i already have Actually, it's the beginning of the month, so I have nothing. I took it out last week for my last paycheck stuffing. So I actually have zero so far this month towards investing. So we're going to go ahead and put 100 into our groceries. So I like to do a 50, 70, 90, and then actually I think I do a couple of 10s. So 50, 70, 80, 90, 95. Okay. Let's double check that. 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100. I like to have these broken down just a little bit for if I make multiple trips. I don't have to spend a large bill. All right, and then next we have gas. Gas is getting 50, 20, 30, 40, We've got 20, 30, 40, 45, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. Eating out is going to get its usual 30. We've actually been really good about not eating out as much this past, this last week we did awesome. Spending is also getting 30. This is just my spending and my husband will get his own. And then while we're here, I'm just going to go ahead and set aside that 30 for my husband. And then I like to say this every video now. My husband also, he gets access to all of these except for my personal spending. So if he needs to pick something up from the grocery store, he does that. If he needs gas, he gets that. If he wants to eat out, you know, he can access that as well. All right. That are, that is all my wallet. Those are all my envelopes in my wallet. Wow, it's a Friday, so I'm having a hard time thinking. <laughs> all right, so we are actually going to head over to our high priority binder and we're gonna stuff my utilities and my phone envelope. So utilities is actually getting a little bit less. I found that I have a lot of leftovers, so I knocked it down a few dollars than I normally do. So we're just gonna be doing 46 this week. And we're gonna see how this plays out this month to see if I We'll still have a good amount. I normally do 48, so I think it'll be just fine though. So, so far for utilities, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96. And I don't track these uh, on my, as far as like the balances like I do for my sinking funds. And phone is getting its usual 35. I was going to make it a goal to get ahead on my utilities and my phone bill. However, I just think I think I'll have to oops. I think I'll have to put that off for another month. And in September, start stuffing extra so that I can be a month ahead on bills. So phone so far has 20, 40, 60. Wow, how did I get that far out of order? 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78. I'm already about say like half a month ahead so really it wouldn't take too much to get me ahead a month 
All right, and that's it for all of my cash envelopes. We are gonna head over to our sinking funds. Health is going to be getting 35 this week. So we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 110, 115, 120, 121. Insurance, which I have my, I got my bill. Um, if you head over to my Instagram, I'll go ahead and put it up on the screen here, Blooming Budgets um, with a Z. Um, you can see I posted a picture of my bill that I got for this and I am almost to my goal um, to pay my six month premium. I'm getting so close. I think it's 600 and some dollars. I can't remember. So let's see where we're at so far. So we're at 1, 2, 3, 354, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 550, 560, 1, 2, and 3. 563. And I believe the bill is 600 and something, like I said. So by the end of this month, I should have that and I should be able to pay that. It's not due for a while, so we should be fine. House is going to get 45 saving for a down payment on a new home. 40 and five. All right, so let's see where we're at. So we've already got 2,000 in the bank. So I've got those two 1K slips there. So we have 2,000. I'm gonna write that down before I forget. 2,000, 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 260, 61, 62. 2,262. All right, emergency fund, we're gonna put 50 in. And we've got one, two, three, three fifty four, four fifty, four seventy, four ninety, five ten, five thirty, five fifty, five fifty one, five fifty two. I'm so happy we're over the five hundred mark for emergency. Had to take out of this a couple weeks ago, but happy that we're back up. Investing, I didn't have any rollover from my wallet, so I'm gonna go ahead and just skip that. And then subscriptions is getting ten dollars. And then we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 46 in subscriptions. All right, so that is it for my high priority. Oops. And then these are my lower priority uh, envelopes here. Doesn't mean they're not important. They just don't usually get stuffed as much as these other ones. I really should move subscriptions over to lower priority, but it's kind of like a bill sort of, so I kind of want to keep it over there. Anyways, moving on, we have gifts is getting 25 this week. So we've got 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 81 in gifts. Entertainment is going to get to 20. And I swear, you guys, as soon as I put cash in here, we spend it. My husband and I are going to the movies again this weekend, and this will be spent on our tickets and popcorn. So I don't know what it is about this entertainment category. We're, I guess maybe I just, my husband and I go on dates a lot. We like to enjoy each other's company. So, and we use that fund. So it's good that we use it though. All right, my husband, Zach, for his sinking fund for his hobbies, he's getting $20. He's getting very close to 100 and I know he has something in mind that he wants to buy, so. All right, we got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. So by the end of this month, he should be at his 100 and I know he's gonna spend it, which is fine. That's what it's there for. All right, vacation is getting 35. We priced our 
plane tickets um, to go see my in-laws in Arizona. And it's gonna be 700 and some dollars for there and back um, for two adults. It's insane how crazy that is. And that's on one of the cheapest airlines. So we really gotta, this is at a good spot, but if we want spending money, you know, we're gonna have to really ramp this up. So I'm gonna be putting more towards vacation in the next few stuffings. Um, because I think we're going in November. So we've got 1, 2, 253, 354, 455, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. So 574 in vacation. So ideally, I don't know if it's at all possible to get this to like 800, honestly, a thousand. <laughs> I really need this at like a thousand. That's insane. I, I might try and come up with some calculations to see what I can do to get us to a thousand for that. So then car is getting 30. We had to take 300 out of this to repair my husband's car. Um, but it just meant that we didn't have to use a check or a credit card, so that's awesome. So we have 51, 20, 40, 60, 82, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So we have 229. And the next bill I have coming due for car is my car registration. And it's 250 some, but that's not also do not due for a couple months. Business is going to be getting 20. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85 in business. Furniture is going to get 25. I feel like I'm speeding through this today, even though I'm really chatty. I feel like my hands are moving fast. So hopefully y'all aren't getting dizzy. What a blur it is in front of you. All right, furniture, we have 51, 152, 253, 354, 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, so 477. This one is also getting close to 500. Christmas is going to get 30. Oops. I'm trying to get this fund to 300 by Christmas. I know it won't cover all my Christmas gifts, but I started really late this year, so it's okay. We've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100. So we're already a third of the way there. Clothes will be getting a 25. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 1, 2, and 3. And our last sinking fund is baby. It's going to be getting 15. I'm not pregnant, I'm just saving for a future child. So we've got 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85. All right, you guys, so that is all my sinking funds. We are gonna go ahead and move on to our 100 envelope challenge, which we are making great progress on. We are going to be able to stuff three envelopes and they're three pretty big envelopes. So I'm happy about that. We're gonna be stuffing envelope 94, 74, and 33. So let me go ahead and pull these. So we've got 94, that's 50, 70, 90, one, two, three, four. I'm just gonna double check that. And today is the 6th of August when I'm filming this. I'm gonna mark off 94. I said last time I was gonna go in with a Sharpie on this sheet and fix it, but I did not get a chance to do that. So maybe next time I will remember. All right, then we're gonna do 
envelope 74. So we've got 50, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4. Mark that off on here. It's my first of the 70s to do. And then also 33. I know I'm gonna be thanking myself later when I do all of these larger ones um, first. So. so we should have 20, 30, one, two, and three. Perfect. Love it when my cash works out perfectly. That is everything I have for you today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe so you don't miss a video. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.